Today is Saturday and I'm weeding off our garden so might as well show you the common weeds that are growing in a Southern California garden. Is this a weed or an ornamental plant? The flowers look pretty so might as well leave this here but this is actually a weed. This one is a very common weed here and you have to remove them while they are small because it's harder to uproot when they are taller. Here is another common weed. I don't see them uh, in spring. They usually come out in like summer, late summer. And there are many of them here in the garden. Let's see here and over there too, like this one. I think this one is, uh, this is only like, see, this is only like one plant and it has like spread out and very easy to remove like that. It's gone. And then here, same thing, same weed. This is dandelion. This is actually edible, but uh, I don't eat them. So time to remove this. Here's another one, and this one spreads out like really fast too. So, and same thing, you have to uproot them while they are like smaller. And this like one grows like all summer, like from spring to summer. And they eventually die too in fall. The, the roots grow deep when they, as they grow taller. It's Saturday, so there are a lot of like those like uh, smaller plants, like doing there those like. Those who have hobby flying planes on weekends. So that's what you're hearing right now. Small planes. Oh my gosh, this one is like I could not uproot them. They're just like So this one is a weed too. I'm not sure what it's called but Again, I, I'm not sure what they are called. This one too. Let's go to the other side to check if there are like other kinds of weed there. I think this one is edible. I'll leave this for now. This one, I'm not sure what they are called, but these are edible. Some type of like weed that is edible. Again, oh, this one is the one that is growing from the stock again. I need to remove it. Some are easy to remove, the others are not. Like this one is easy to remove, like see? I uprooted the entire thing. It's only like one weed and it's like, it has spread out. These ones are like really, sometimes like you don't know, like see for example, when they are as small as this, you don't really know if this is a weed or like a seedling. Look at this, it has like spread out like really wide. And there's only like one, it's only like one plant from here, as you can see, but really easy to remove like that. So, I have this here. <laughs> and here, one more here. Oh, this is not one. These are like many. I'm not sure if this is the same one we call like kulitis in the Philippines, but 
but I think this is edible but I'm not sure so a fruit <laughs> and see all this like um this thing this like weed that's a lot of them and here's another weed I think this is dandelion too this is the same one with uh, white flowers and this one they have like tiny purple flowers but they are very invasive i don't think they are like ornamental plants i think they are like weeds so might as well remove them and i have this um nasturtiums here and then I have the hydrangea here. Some of the leaves have dried off. Here's hydrangea. They are very easy to remove though. Like look at that. Very easy to uproot. See? I think this one too is the same thing. It's a weed. So there are a lot of different kinds of weeds growing on this side this one this one is harder to uproot but not <laughs> not the specific one but usually harder to uproot this ones are weeds too let's check for more weeds on this side here's another one a different kind of weed oh look at this i think this is a surprise I used to have like um, purple spinach, I think that's what it's called. No, purple spinach or... Oh, Malabar spinach. I used to have a Malabar spinach here, like on a pot. And then it has like seeds. And then it's growing. It has like... Look at this. I think I need to provide this with a trellis. There's another seedling here. <laughs> but these are thyme. And then... Yeah, like this one. I have one over there so I can remove this. This is not a weed. This is a chives. This one and um, what else? See, look at this one. And then this one, it looks like thyme. When the soil is wet, it's very easy to remove them or uproot them. What else? These are dried like fennel. This. If there are a lot of weeds, I usually ask our gardener to help me <laughs> remove them. here between the mints oh this one is a weed but like you know this one the one with uh, like the this is like wood sorrel or like false clover I think it's called false, false clover they look like clover leaves and uh, I don't remove them there are weeds too but I don't remove them because they're pretty flowers yellow flowers oh i uprooted the main too along with this weeds so like here in between the mint is one it's harder to uproot or like you know you just remove the you're just removing the leaves and not really uprooting the entire thing and they grow back It, but maybe no I might like uproot the the mint too since it's it is growing in between the mint oh. let's see 
if it goes back. It's here. It's here in the middle. I don't think I I need a shovel. So if they don't go with just like pulling them, then I usually use this to like uproot the entire thing. Because if you if I don't, they'll just go back. Like that. Okay, let me fix this first. <laughs> 